accredited school. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be really recognized. Uh, you actually get a PhD in philosophy behind it. All of it is all legit. Okay. It's backed by real schools. It's credited by real schools. I really, I mean, it's amazing. We've been putting in a lot of work, brother. So uh, make sure that you stay in contact with us. Bro. Yeah, 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 man. And take my, get my info. Get, you got his own info? Yes, sir. You see his name on there? Yeah. All right, now be got it. He screenshot you. We're going to hit you up. Sir, I appreciate hey, it, man. Hey, good looking at what you're doing with them children, though, man. Children need black males that's doing something positive within the community for they to look up to. So I just oh, want to yeah. say I salute you, brother, straight up. Oh, yeah, it's a whole group. And taking that responsibility, brother. We salute you, man. We need yes, some sir. black leaders and males in the community really rearing up these young black men. Yes, sir. And we appreciate this truthful you knowledge that you're spending. Uh, he said he don't see it, so I need your I need uh, your at real fast. It's uh at G D is in dog R E I D three at G D R E I D three. Yep. All right, got you, brother. All right, he go. He, oh, okay, Nisha just sent it. Thank you, Nisha. All right, All right. Uh, we go. We going you up tonight, yes, sir. Hey, I'm gonna send some pictures to them boys. Yeah, hey, and, and send some pictures of the boys, and send some pictures of the of your uh, of your small garden. Yeah, bro. yeah, I do. All right, all right, peace, King. I like that right there, boy. See, he got he got he gonna be a part of the army. That's why I like why I like them brothers. That's about their business. Hang up, you gotta hang up, King. Hang up, dude. Nah, you still on there, brother? Right, it's that man. little X button, top left. Ah, right, okay. Who else we got? Who else we got? Peace, peace, oh, young God. God this, what up, this King? This is crazy. This is crazy. What's good? What's your name, God? Where you from? My name is I'm from uh, Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. Markel from the PA. What's up with the God? Sure, yes, sir. I'm a, I'm a musician, man. I've been um, putting in work just over the years, just studying, man, like really tapping in with the knowledge. And um, my mother put me on to you. Oh, and, great. Um, Shouts out to the moms, yeah. man. Shouts out to her. Yeah, she had a... Uh, she has lupus, and um, one time, like probably, dang, I just got nervous. My bad. It's all good. Man. It's all <laughs> but, good. Man. You talk. You talk yeah, to a brother. You talk to a brother. We brothers, just yeah. like you. I ain't yeah. nobody, brother. For sure, for sure. Yeah, I'm um, 24, and um, I'm really on the path of just really tapping in. And you've been a, a, a just a great light, like you said, Doctor savior has been for you. You've been there for me, and um, oh, I've been studying herbalism. I've been getting tapped in with the. Uh, Bioflavonoids yeah. and molecular structures. Hey, that's what I'm no, talking even, about, bro. Yeah, man, yeah. Even with yeah. like what you broke down with the seedless um fruits with the tetraploids yeah. and yeah. all of that type of stuff. Yeah, yeah. So you gonna... really you really getting into science nutrition of the molecular structure of seeds. Yeah. That's where the true knowledge is that a lot of people not studying, brother. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You're starting to get into tetraploids, the diploids, yeah. the karyopsis, the different classifications of fruits and vegetables. Once you once you learn that knowledge. It shows you the whole secrets of the universe. Yeah. Straight up, brother. I, I agree, man. And um, where I'm at with it now is uh, I've been self-studied, man. Um, I went to college. I was playing uh, football in college at Slippery Rock over near Pittsburgh. Yeah. And um, once that changed up for me, I've had three surgeries on my leg uh -huh. and just rejuvenating my body um, from the nerves and the sky uh -huh. nerves and, and just all that type of stuff, man. It's led me to basically my question is i'm just trying to figure out i know you just got your phd man like congrats yeah, appreciate man. like yeah, appreciate it. bottom you know um i'm just trying to figure out the routes the best route to go to become just official like i'm, I'm at that point in my life where you know i'm about to be 25 next year and i just want to i want to have those type of accolades and those certifications so, to push first thing you need to, first thing you need to do is uh you need to get a master herbalist certificate and you can get that with me you can get that with me. Uh, man, you can actually get a lot of this stuff with us now. Yeah, you can take it all the way up with us. The uh, only thing that I can't give out, only thing I can't give out personally is a biochemistry certification. Okay, mm -hmm. And I'm working on that now. We just started that. So I probably should have my biochemistry certification in probably like another year. Where, mm -hmm. well, well, I got my certification, but where I'm, where I'm able to certify others. Yeah, I got to get some more hours in there. I got to get a lot of more hours in that, but we working on that too. So once I get them hours down, what I'm what I'm doing is building an official 
helped school, all around school. I've been keeping it quiet until I got all of my degrees. And since I got most of them in, I'm loud with it now. But we've been working silently for a minute now. So you can get all of them with me now and tell uh, but, the, uh, but the biochemistry. But I'm going to give you a site where you can go on and you can do a free biochemistry lesson. And they will actually give you a, a certification, but it's not going to be official. And you can go through hard. Harvard University to do that. So just go through your Harvard University, check out the uh, EDX classes. They should have a free biochemistry course. Brother, look at me. It's one of the hardest damn courses in life. <laughs> and you're talking about a person, you talk about a person with a biochemistry course, but I love the way it really challenged me though. It challenged my mind and everything. Uh, it's a bunch of stuff in there that's pretty, pretty academic where you're going to where you're going to disagree with learning how we learn from ourselves. Mm. But so you're going to, it's going to be a lot of indoctrination in there. Just stay true to self though. Yeah. Cause you're going to start swapping a bunch of information. That's the only thing that I've been running into with this information where I'd be having to talk to not be all the time. Like, man, I had, a, this is what I say, not being racist, but I'm like, damn, I just had a white man moment because yeah. it'll, it'll bring you back into academia. And then you forget all the clinical trials and all the experiments that you did yourself that brought a different outcome. Mm -hmm. So always stay true to, true to you, your own work and what you believe to be true and what you have proven because you will mix their doctrine with yours and you will start sounding like them and you will forget you did your research that produced a different outcome from them. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, so just make sure you be make sure you be careful yeah, with that. But uh, like, so Harvard is... University, go in there and take that free class, brother. I'll be in it, man. You know what I mean? This is all self study. You know what I'm saying? All self study, man. And um, just 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 type it in, man. I, I told myself, you know, you, I just look at it like you know, yours you for where you at right now, your age, man. I feel like I'm I'm in that. That bracket of my age, bro. I'm 24. I'm trying to. You 24. I'm 35. Yeah. If you keep this up, you will be better than me. You see what I'm saying? You will be better than me at 35. You will hey, be man, better trying, than me, brother. And that's I'm what trying, that's what man. it's about, man. Yeah, we gotta I, outdo. We gotta outdo each other. You know what I'm saying? Any anybody that any of my students that's not better than me by the time they get my age, that mean I failed as a teacher. Man, I you, failed. You you've done impeccable work man like impeccable work and i just salute you for what you're doing and I, you know i'm built bulking up on the herbs and i want to do i want to just follow that path that's the path that i feel like god's giving man, look, me keep it up yeah. god uh i want you i want you to be a part of our mentorship program uh me and i be are starting a mentorship program i would love for you to be a part of it bro you 24 you young yeah. you with it your mind not be come out in real quick tell them how to reach out to you I want you to be a part of our program. We kick it, We actually kicking the program off at the, in the uh, middle of February. And uh, this is my uh, uh, manager, my, my personal He's assistant. Here. He do everything for me, man. He organize everything, and he gonna be reaching out to so, me. Yeah, bro. I'm gonna be, I, I've been hearing about y'all, man. I, man, I, I, I stay too. I see well, y'all keep live, and I'm tapping in. You know what I'm saying? The farm, everything y'all been doing, and just how you guys represent the, the two men, the team. It's, it's important. And you as an OG, you know, being able to just facilitate every just what y'all doing man it's, it's amazing and i think that it's a great it's just it's just a great thing man let's build bro let's build let's, let's build for sure people. for sure man I, I, you need help out there man I, yeah man i need your information i'm, I'm and i'm gonna reach out to you, you. get it my, give, me your, my, my get your call. give me your um ig information okay it's official markel m-a-r-k-e-l-l j j-a-y yeah that's gonna be no, he can be a part of the uh, program. Okay. All right. And that's official Markel J. Yep. All right. And that's it. All right. I'm going to reach out to you now. Be used to okay. you in just a few minutes. Got you. All right. I'm sure Nisha done sent it to me. I hit my phone. Yeah. Uh -huh. Well, Nabi, they on you. They say Nabi look good. <laughs> <laughs> These women in this country hey, going on you, Nabi. You and that gorilla you, mix. <laughs> I'm, I'm, on that, I'm on that gorilla mix too, man. As soon as it come out, because. I was a D two athlete, and you know, I, I'm I'm still in shape. I mean, I'm still trained heavy, man. So I definitely would love to see how that goes. All right, let's do it, brother, man. Stay up on it. I'll be gonna reach out to you, man. Let's let's build it, man. Yeah, let's build, I man. The, I see what the creator doing, man. Uh, I just put a big old post out there and talked about all the the backlash and all the faking that was going on in the healing community and how we need to stop that shit. And then this live, and I just see how it's coming together, man. Like I think I think I want to put together like a big old seminar with all the healers. I just want to yeah. come together and show the world. You know what I'm saying, like. That we can we can do this together without hating each other and without having competition. Yeah. And you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Stuff like that. So we coming up with something, brother. We're gonna link you up. Representing it the perfect way, man. And um 
I think it's just it's just showing where your heart's at. It's when you when your heart's in a pure frequency and vibration, that's what emanates out. So that's exactly what you represent. And I think that, you know, you're 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 a legend, man. I appreciate you, you brother. Appreciate you, man. Yep. Shouts out to you. I'll talk to you soon, all right? Yeah, for sure. All right, peace, King. Peace out. Listen. That just gave me the fuel I need tonight for the gym. That's what I needed. I needed to hear that. I just got my fuel from the gym, y'all. I ended up leaving my gorilla, uh, my gorilla mix muscle up at the house. Oh, yeah, we left. I left. I left the gorilla mix, but that young brother just gave me. He just gave me the seminar I need to 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 do my workout when I get off this live. I'm gonna do one more. I'm gonna do more. Yes, yes, y'all. Uh, I want to put together. I want to put together a healing conference where I bring out other healers y'all it's time to do dump something different in the community where y'all don't see us bashing each other all the time you know what i'm saying uh i i usually don't listen to other healers but lately you know me and i be been searching for them and looking through everybody's stuff and we've been finding some good people you know that's, that speak some good information even if i disagree with them i see that their intentions is good they're not out here killing people with the information they're not having pissing contests they doing their thing you know what i'm saying and they and they, they don't have to shit on nobody else to do their thing and them the ones that i want uh on stage with me man straight up that's that's why i want to link up with man i see and i'm seeing these healers and i'm seeing these brothers and sisters and it's like it's time for us to come together time to form the power ranger team right. And I think it'd be dope. We all coming from different ideologies, but we all got the same intentions. I'm spitting what I'm spitting. You spitting what I'm spitting. You know, everybody can come and get what they need from the info and take it and then apply it. And how you, how you get healed is how you get healed from it. There's many different ways. I don't like saying to skin the cat, but there's many different met methodologies to healing mind, body, spirit, and the soul. But we got to start showing the community something different than all of this gossiping, lying, pointing the finger at each other and trying to make each other look bad and talk down on each other. Like, that shit got to stop immediately. So we're going to put together a big old healing conference, y'all. That's what we're doing. That's that's my word. I'm going to do one more. We're going to get up out of here. All right, I'm going to scroll with this one. Let's do it. Let's see what we got. Man, KT Arch Degree. Uh, I, I done spoke to him several times. That's my boy. Uh, Dr. Bobby Price. Uh, man, I've been listening to his stuff lately. You know what I'm saying? I, I like how he come. He come from a more, you know, uh, laid back standpoint. He not he not a real radical. So, like, he can talk to a different crowd of people. So, uh, Dr. Bobby Price. KT Arch Degree, that's my dude right there. I love, I love the way he spit. He more of a, he more of a spaz on me. He hit you with something. He, he pretty dope. Uh, man, it's a bunch of, it's a bunch of herbalists out here. I'm not the only herbalist, y'all. It's a bunch of us out here, and a lot of us got good intentions. Unfortunately, it's just, it's just a, a one little handful of Negroes that just act like cockroaches, and you know they just act like vampires, and they, they won't clout and they won't fame, and and it's messing with their head. But I believe once they see all of us come together, I believe that's gonna stop though. Or, you know, the 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 creator got a way of sizzling people out. You know what I'm saying? The creator got a way of of moving unrighteous people out of the fold. And I think when the righteous minds, the collective come together, you know what I'm saying? The weak, the weak and the evil ain't got no choice but to fall. So yeah, shouts out to KT Arts Degree. Shouts out to uh Dr. Bobby Price. Shouts out to anybody that's out here healing the people. Or in speaking good intentions over the people. All right. Well, we yeah, we, I'm gonna do one more, y'all. Where y'all at? I guess it ain't gonna let me tell you no more because I don't see the lot add to button. Can you see me? Oh, you is on here. Where well, yeah, yeah. God, I don't even see you. I hear you. Oh, but I don't see you. oh okay. No, I was um. It's showing my face on mine, so I don't know why not. It's not showing you. <laughs> That's crazy. I straight do not see you. Hold on, let me try to go out. Okay. I don't see you, but go ahead, talk to me. What's up with you, goddess? Um, mine is about like pulsation. I've been having like pulsation in the chest and like in my throat, and I think it's dealing with like I know for a fact it's dealing with I need magnesium. I know that for a fact, you and I think I need to super, flush out the. Bad. Can you hear me? I can. Nope, you breaking up super so you sound like a robot. You want me to um leave out and come back? Nope, you sound good now. I hear you. Okay. I said I was dealing with like pulsations in the throat and in the neck. Mm -hmm. Well, in my chest too. I okay. know it's dealing with like 
magnesium. I'm low on magnesium. Yep. Um, uh, yep. Low magnesium, and you have too much calcium, so it's causing a, a vasal constriction of the arteries and that, uh -huh. that vasal constriction is so hard that you will hear that it's kind of like you can hear it in your yeah. ear yeah so, i can hear it the, so that's the sinoatrium atrium two of your heart mm -hmm. and it's an actual part in your brain too so if you get more magnesium into your system though that'll fix that problem and it's funny you called in but you already know how to fix the problem yeah but i was just like what my thing is i know because i study the body very very well um, but my thing is, I didn't know exactly what herbs are, what exactly I need to take to flush out the body, to cleanse the body, because I eat natural, naturally already. I eat natural fruits, natural vegetables. I don't do the milk. Um, I, if I do like a pack of meat, it lasts me. Um, I got fish in the refrigerator or the freezer right now. It'll last me almost a whole month. It'll take me a month, maybe even two months to eat it. So mm -hmm. I know I don't really really eat meat at all mm -hmm. i know my body can't even handle the meat um i listen to my body and things like that i eat a lot of fruits a lot of vegetables a lot of water you, um i even got a garden breaking up again so look hear me since you breaking up if you can hear me i'm gonna just tell you what you need to do okay so what, what you need to do is you need to so dark leafy greens most of your dark leafy greens are very very high in uh magnesium so i will do dark leafy greens i'll make sure that i'm eating at least at least a plate of those a day, dark leafy greens. If you can, get you some microgreens and put them on top of that. Also, your fruits. Your fruits, more of your melons have a bunch of magnesium in them as well. So make sure that you incorporate melons, whether it's honeydew melon, whether it's watermelon, whether it's cantaloupe, whether any of your melons, get your bitter melon, make it papaya is a melon. Make sure you're getting your melons in as well. Squashes. Squashes have a bunch of magnesium in it as well and then i can't talk about the sweet potato enough the sweet potato okay. is a freaking superfood i'm telling you okay. just you know put yeah rub it down rub it down with some extra virgin olive oil cut it open and cut it open and put it in the oven and just let it do its baking thing put some rosemary some cilantro and some basil and stuff on it and eat it that way that is full of potassium and full of magnesium as well also it's a bunch of magnesium actually in your spring water oh. but you have to get okay. natural spring water so make sure you increase your spring water uh what i would do is probably about 20 ounces of spring water a day and then i would do 25 ounces of the geogenetic juice a day okay. that's what i would do if i was you and then right, what about your 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 detoxes because i seen now, you had a lot which one would i, which one, would I so, which one is the best one for that the cardio the cardiovascular kit the okay. cardiovascular kit off the website will do good for you and the reason why is because it's going to remove all the buildup calcium that's inside of the uh, vascular system or the artery of venous walls it's going to automatically get uh, rid of that uh, it got a bunch of magnesium and iron phosphate in it so it's going to bring a bunch of oxygen and that's going to allow not only uh, uh, uh dilation to the actual artery walls but you're going to get rid of all the stagnation and any calcification that's on the artery walls and it's going to relax that heart too where you don't have that strong beat to send that pulsation right. to the to the uh, sino atrium anyway so it'll be the cardiovascular kit with the diet that i just recommended you with that water that liquid intake i just recommended you that's what i would do now i got a question are you getting any heart palpitations from it or uh anxiety or panic yeah. attacks from what you got going on yeah, well i've been having that since i was young so, so would, that's something i've been dealing with since i was young I want you to check that thyroid too. It might be a, th a, a underlining thyroid issue as well. And you might be missing aldine. So I want you to check your thyroid. And if your thyroid numbers are low, just start incorporating more sea vegetables. Get you some nori, get you some kelp, get you some dose, you know, uh, get you some sea moss and get you some bladder rack. And just every now and then throughout the day, eat you some of them things too. That way you're getting the efficiency, the efficient amount of actual aldine into the system to help regulate your, your metabolic, uh, your metabolic functioning okay okay i was just I'm, i mean i just didn't know exactly which one to take because i was going back from um, what's that called um black seed oil i was taking different stuff to flush out the body no um so follow you, black, seed, black seed oil is more of a stimulant than a flusher mm -hmm. don't get me wrong black seed oil is amazing especially when it comes to certain different organs in the body, but black seed oil is very, very hard and heavy on the liver. So just make mm. sure you be careful with it. Same thing when it comes to cilantro oil and it comes to oregano oil. They're very, very 
hard and heavy on the liver. So we got to be careful when it comes to, you know, ingesting that and taking it every single day. Uh, go go with what I told you to go with, and I think you'll be very, very good. And then test out those seed vegetables and those seed herbs as well. Uh, they'd be okay. very good for you as well. I have and that's what you need. And I think one more question, if you don't mind answering. Go ahead. Um, I have a nephew who he went through chemo and cancer and things like that. He's mm -hmm. trying to he's heal trying his skin. He's he's trying to heal his skin. And I told him it takes time. It's not going to, you know, work overnight to heal the face and the skin because the skin is changing, you know, different colors and things like that. His doctor was telling him, you know, he's consistently losing weight. And he's like, I don't know what to that's, do. That's or, chemotherapy. Yeah. yeah. So chemotherapy burns the cells. Mm -hmm. Chemotherapy dehydrates the body. Chemotherapy melts the liver, which is going to mess with the bilirubin and change the color of the skin. Chemotherapy, it literally kills the nervous system, which makes all the hair fall out. And yeah. it suppresses appetite, which yeah. keeps you from being yeah. hungry, so you don't want to eat. Yeah, so you never you, want to eat. When you remove chemotherapy, you got to do it real slow because you can really harm the person by putting them on a heavy detoxification and pulling all of that mustard gas from the deep tissue and the interstitial fluid. So the best thing to do when somebody just suffers from chemotherapy is to put them on a all fruit diet. Now it's some herb, it's some it's some vegetables, so it's all fruit and vegetables, but the vegetables mm -hmm. is going to be a part of the brassica uh, cruciferous family, uh -huh. sulforaphane, broccoli sprouts. Anybody that been through any type of chemotherapy, any client of mine, I always put them on broccoli sprouts because you have something called glucoraphanin, you have uh -huh. something called sulforaphane, and these things are, are, are very, very good by opening up new metabolic pathways of the cells and pulling chemotherapy from the cells and, and getting them to the lymph nodes without them destroying other cells. Yeah. You can look this up, y'all. Y'all can just look up chemotherapy, uh, radiation detoxification through glucoraphane and sulforaphane. The first thing that's going to pop up over over ten to twelve different uh, scholarly uh, articles, articles, uh, scientific articles talk about broccoli sprouts. Broccoli sprouts remove chemotherapy more than soursop. Okay, so, yeah, because he was taking a lot of that, um, the soursop. Even I did, um, me and him, when I was out there, because I'm from Cali, all my family out there, mm -hmm. but me and him was doing, like, the aloe, because I know aloe berries give um, oxygen to the body, mm -hmm. and it's mm -hmm. dealing with the cells, so mm -hmm. I was just like, well, you know, eat a lot of berries, drink your aloe, but when he was in the hospital, you know, they're going to tell him whatever it is they want him to know, so they was telling him, you know, don't eat the berries. That's bad for you. Don't no. take the aloe. And he was scared. His mom was scared. Berries. And I'm like, you need he that, you know. Berries yeah. are oxygenators. He needs those. Aloe vera is an oxygenator. He can use yeah. that. Uh, uh, water can be a very, very good oxygenator if it's pure and if it's clean. He can use that. All cancer is is when the body is deprived of oxygen in the first place and have to go an anaerobic route. And it, and it, it makes basically causes the cells to adapt and then a mutation takes form and this is where you get the tumors from. So do everything I told you. Well, tell him to do everything I just said and, and get that chemo out. And then once that chemotherapy right. is out of him, then we can start the healing process. But it's impossible to heal when you have chemotherapy, mustard gas uh, derivatives inside of your bloodstream. I'm, yeah. I'm just letting you know that now. So you have he's to scared the to go outside. First. They're yes. telling him, don't even go in the sun. And yeah, I'm cause like... Because chemotherapy makes you allergic to the yeah, sun. That's what I was telling my sister. I'm like, you got to slowly get him off of that. And they just, you know, paranoid, trusting in them. You know, they trust both. They do both, but they still paranoid because they not doing their research. So I told them, I said, you got to slowly take your time. And mm -hmm. they just in a paranoid type of mindset. Got you. I got yeah. You. So look, let's get a meal, man. Stay on them. Keep doing what you're doing. And, uh, you know, make sure you send out some good affirmations and prayers for them. Stay right. on top of them. And, and let's get them healed on up. All right. Thank you. All right, peace, love, light, and healing to you. All right, you too. So, yeah, let's, let's do it. Let's put together a massive conference, man, of uh, some of the best healers, the ones that got, you know, the ones that's out here really doing some work and they got good intentions. So we're going to hit up uh, uh, Bobby Price. We're going to hit up KT. Uh, I got I just got T-Walk. I got T-Walk number today. I need to call him. Get T-Walk on the line. Yeah, we're going to build the Avengers team. I've been talking about it for a couple of years. It's time to do it. But look, y'all, peace, love, light, and healing. I love y'all. Uh, it's time to bring peace to the conscious community. 
It's trying to bring peace to the healing community. It's trying to bring peace to the whole entire melanated community. We is looking bad out here. We we looking like monkeys and ass fools out here. Other communities looking at us and shaking their head, man. And you know, uh, I feel like if ain't nobody else gonna be the the example and take and take lead and charge, I am. So it is what it is. So uh, I love all my healers. I love all my brothers and sisters. I don't got no beef. Uh, well, I'd be lying if I said I ain't had no beef for nobody, because I do. <laughs> but I love all of y'all, though. So peace, love, light, and healer. Peace to the guys. Peace to the earth. I'm going to be live again tomorrow. Uh, doing the same thing. Be live all week. Uh, yeah, Dr. Yaki, Raphael Elohim, you know, Awaken PhD, biochemist. You know what I'm saying? Certified nutrition. So, man, I got so many certifications that we getting up there, man. We got our own accredited school. I graduate April the 19th. April 19th. Well, no, the 20th is graduation. 19th is the... All right, I graduate April the 20th in L.A. We're making a flyer. Make sure y'all be there to support me. I'm getting a building that can hold at least 5,000 people because, you know, I bring everybody out. And, man, look, we doing our seminar. We doing our premiere. We doing we do y'all gonna be at a workout with me. We doing a three day event in LA. So you know what I'm saying? It's gonna be April 19th, 20th, and 21st. So the flowers will be up soon. Hey, look, let's build. Peace of the light of hill, peace of the gods, peace of the earth, peace.